Hello, Edmund. Good night, lads. Oh, it's a game, it's a game. I'm a detective now, Edmund. It's true, it's true as I'm here, I'm a detective. I'll tell you all about it, Edmund, listen. I've always been fond of adventure, I have, and finding things slow for a time. I thought as detective I'd start on my own, I've got such a knowledge of crime. One look at a crook and I shrivel him up, and when I'm disguised in my beard, I'm altered so much that I don't know myself, cause I look so ferocious and weird. I'm Snooty, the dread of the head. If they play the king, I have the ace. I know every one of their footprints. I've had all the luck on my face. Sherlock Holmes is a rotten detective. He ought to be playing ping pong. And when I'm on their track, crooks all tremble and say, Oh, the police will have me before long. Oh, it's the game, this detective business, I'll give you my word, Edmund. Listen. One night with me bloodhounds, I ran to the lair, a gang called the Desperate Three. They were throwing big handfuls of mud at the door, and they started to throw some at me. And just as I opened my mouth to shout help, bang into my mouth a pile goes. My whistle was useless, I couldn't blow that, so to beat them I just blew my nose. And once while disguised as a cat, I went to a young lady's school in search of a burglar they had there. I felt quite collected and cool while strolling about in the rooms there. Some young ladies screamed out from their beds. What are you looking for, puss? I said, looking for mice. I'm sleuthy the dread of the head. <laughs> oh, what a game it is. I could open your eyes if I tell you some about my adventures, Edmund. I could listen. Listen, a lady stepped into my office last week and reported to me a great crime. Somebody had stolen some stockings of hers. She'd hung out to dry on a line. I want you to find them, she said. I said, right. So I fixed on my beard and rushed out. And in less than three days, those stockings I saw on some legs that were walking about. And I followed those stockings for miles. Where they went to, so I went into tea shops and tubes and theatres. I wouldn't be put off the scent. Well, I got them at last and I showed them to the lady all torn into shreds. How'd you get them, she cried. I never tell tales. I'm sleuthy the dread of the head. The game, Edmund, is Don't you worry about it, I've got some surprises for you.